this video, I'm gonna show you how to make this awesome looking triceratops head. So, yeah, it's just the head, but it's really detailed and it has the lower jaw and the cool looking eyes and horns. This is my brand new design and so let's start but uh, before I start uh, I just want to tell you that many of the people watch my videos but don't subscribe subscribe so uh, I assure you that I, I'm gonna upload good videos so please to support my work subscribe to my channel okay so let's start so here you can see I'm using a 21 centimeter by 21 centimeter yellow printer paper. So you can use actually any paper, but I prefer using a thicker paper for shaping purposes. So yes, let's start. So first fold along the diagonals. then fold along the edges so now we want to make the um, world base so yeah something like this just collapse them all on the existing folds like this so now what you wanna do is fold up now this is a random fold but it needs some precision so now just fold up and fold these uh, these edges inside the pocket it's, it's not the uh, fold which goes parallel to the center the whole way it just goes parallel to the Top midpoint. Now, what you want to do is make it deflect from the uh, the uh, center line and just make it go something, something like this. Yeah. Something like this. The same thing on this other side. this and again on the top so now the, uh, the model will not lie flat so what you wanna do is fold till it goes and then just doesn't doesn't go in your way so it like it is like this then you wanna do is make it go down and then uh, make a fold so it, uh, it is actually an inverted rabbit ear fold something like this so now it will make the model lie flat something like this ok 
Küche. Now I do the similar thing on the back. So on this this edge is fold fold uh, the back flap and then so it actually goes parallel to the uh, this edge which you just created and then fold it about here this is all up to your taste how you want to make the uh, details on the uh, price items You do the same thing on the other side as well. And make it go similar and it's, it should be um, equal on both sides. So it is symmetrical. Okay. okay so this is what we have came up with till now. Now what we're gonna do is change this fold. So make it go a little bit back. Okay, a bit like this. And just make it um, something like this, yeah. So you have a small equilateral triangle around here. here is. So now what you're gonna do is make the front home, right? So what you will do is make this flap between two points, these, this point and this point here. Just let it go inside. Like this. And then Make it go back up, and then, and then just wrap it here, but a little bit in the front of this line. So it's not uh, edge to edge; it's a little bit in front of the edge. Something like this. Then just thin down this. But first, let's create the whole model and we'll just add some shaping bits to it. So, yeah, this is uh, the front, uh, the upper jaw, and now this is the lower. So, now if you want the mouth a bit more open, then you can just change this flap and make it go back up. So, that is what I'm gonna do, like this. Absolutely up, you, up to your taste. Okay, so now I will just fold this flap down, and ma make it go back up. So to make it 3D, these are actually crimps and pleats. So it will make the model look 3D. -er. So now what you're going to do is rabbit ear these horns, these horns. To make them actually thinner and much better than the existing flat. Okay. This is what you come up with. Right? And the same thing on this side as well. So 
gonna do with this. Then, what you're gonna do is actually fold this point, this point, back. About here. So like, yeah, this much. Now this is on purely on taste. Then just make them a bit rounded. Okay. Make them a bit rounded. Something like this. And then just make this point also go inside. So now what you are going to do is actually pull this so it goes a bit down and then just collapse the model. So again, pull over here so flap will come out and just yeah make it symmetrical and then just collapse yeah so then like this and then as I told you before just round off the points something like this now this is actually the basic now, to make it look better like this one what you want to do is first make the eyes about here and then what you're gonna do is make a pleat as simple as that like this and here as well just make it symmetrical to make it look better and more proportional. Something like this. And what you're gonna do is just make the lower jaw better in shape. And then just thin down the Okay, so what you're gonna do is take this and just push it inside. It will go automatically inside. It will give it a better shape to it. Something like this. Then just to see this is open, right? To make it a lock, just take both of the edges and just fold them to one side right like this now you can just change the position of the jaw as per your taste so now this is what the basic triceratops now I'll teach you how to make it how to shape it uh, in an advanced manner Something like this. Now this is uh, what you have blocked. Now what you're gonna do is uh, just uh, to make it more realistic. Just push, push just uh, part of the mouth inside and give it a bit of curved beak-like structure. This is more realistic. like and then push between the pleats to make it look 3d
just mix some advanced um, shaping, the, the advanced shaping tricks. And just mop the plate in its position. Absolutely on your taste. So you can just shape it as you want. If you don't like the shaping, you can just change the shaping. Okay. Something like this. Then the back of the head. Now here just pinch between the corners. Pinch between the corners like this. So this is the edge pinch between to make sort of pointy structures and spread it and just make it look better so now this is how it looks now uh, I told you to use uh, thicker paper so yeah so this is the thicker paper and you can see the results are much better in this one than this one. So, okay, this is what you will get in the end. Now, you can use actually glue just to shape. I'm using, using the word shape. See, I have used a glue right here to seal this part. Now, you can see that it splits apart even after it's locked. So that is what I'm gonna tell I just tell you. Okay. So now I'm gonna show you around it so you can make it out. So yeah, this is it. points I told you about the eye the lower jaw so now here I'm going to show you so yeah tell me So, hope you guys were able to make it and uh, please like this video if you, are, you, if you enjoyed this video and please comment if you have any doubts about uh, any, uh, any, anything in origami. Now, and please subscribe to my channel.